On this episode of Homegrown Experience, our very own Austin Musselman joins good friend Bill Mudd, and they head to the beautiful Utah mountains in search of giant mule deer. Invited back, right? Yeah, well, we'll see. We're gonna give him a day or so. Bill, this is Tom Land. He's the yeah. head. Tom, how are you? Head nice to meet you. Here. Nice to meet you. If you would get my foot rest, I'd really be sad. All right, we're on like Donkey Kong. What's the name of the deer we're going after? Badass. Yeah, I like that. You don't get a name like that unless you're badass, right? That's right. seen a big four by four old mature bug he jumped up out of his bed and he's running down this valley we're gonna try to make a circle on him had a good encounter, good stock on these muleys. Just a little bit too small, as Tom Lance says. Good luck today. You're supposed to wear bras on your face. Well, you know. Oh, come on, you can't, you can't put me on blast like that. When you got you a fetish, right? I do, it's yeah. like, Don't tell me. <laughs> I'm <laughs> sick. Yeah. All right, well, good luck. And no, this is not a brassiere. <laughs> this is a face mask. Okay, it looks like the little white bud on a mule deer, right? So it just brings them in. Well, don't shoot me. Yeah, I yeah, won't. Make sure you use your binos and not your I'll see that to orange check out the animals. All right. All right, buddy. Good luck Good out there. So glad you made it out here. It's uh, an incredible place. Thanks it, for sharing it with me. Well, it's uh, you know we've been lucky. We've known each other what almost eight years now, probably. Yeah, probably that long. Yeah. Been on several bird hunts together: Argentina, Spain. Spain. Uh, fly and, fishing trip. Yep, yeah, went on a fly fishing trip and. Yep. Yeah. Well, it's your first Western hunts this year. We this is our second hunt together. We went to got to go to New Mexico and both got an elk and that was a great trip and then now we're here and I'm well, so happy you got your buck and I wish I could have been there uh, with you and you know your guy Colton luckily got you know used his cell phone and uh, and his spotting scope and got a lot of the hunt. I haven't seen him since the first week of August he's been an elusive deer he's a buck we saw last year and uh, he's packed on quite a few inches from last year Mature buck. Old mature deer, kind of deer we want to try and kill. So he was about 2,000 yards away. We watched him probably um, uh, over an hour. From he that was, distance? From that distance, just glassing him through the optic. He's been acting like he wants to bed, and once he beds, we've got good wind. We'll uh, go make a play. So we can go down and sneak a little bit closer to him, get yeah. a little nice advantage. There he goes. 
Nice. Yeah. He's down, he's dude. Down. That's perfect. That's perfect. Nice work. That is perfect. Okay, let's go. So we got back in the truck, drove kind of over on another ridge, hiked, I don't know, several hundred yards, if not a thousand yards up a up an incline, and we had a nice view down to about 240 yards shot. You thought he was going to stand up, but it, 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 you, you waited quite a while, and then it could have been hours and hours and hours, and you took a shot. What it was took a shot up. while he was bedded yeah. down. I mean, he was kind of exposed, and uh -huh. we were afraid that if he did get up, he would walk into the wood line. I'm ready when you are. You made and a great uh, shot. It dropped him, and uh, you got that new gun. You've been practicing, and uh, my heart was beating on this one. <laughs> this one was fun. That, this was amazing. If you quit, if quits happening like that, then you need to quit hunting, right? I know. Well, awesome. Well, let's keep at it. All right, buddy. All right, man. Ooh, that one looks good. A giant buck, he's 750 yards. It's too far for me to shoot. We're gonna ease out, and try to get a little closer. That's him. All right, you guys ready? Thanks, buddy. We worked hard, man. He, he worked got, hard with us. Pender, give it to me. That was awesome. Oh, dude, it's a beautiful 4x4. <laughs> Thank you again. Wow. Oh, gosh. Look how big this deer is. Oh, my gosh. He's awesome. Super wide, deep forks. Oh, I'm so happy, man. What a great hunt. That's awesome. <laughs> Woo! Dude, you guys came way down. He first made for this road. He did it. Both of us. <laughs> Thanks to these guys. Yeah, great job. I'm tickled with this deer, man. I love it.